All right, now we have the money waddle uh, set up with the... Um, my base is built up there. We have this Maka waddle, which is set up with sour... I think it's level 7? Yeah, sour 7, so it does damage. Not a lot of damage, but damage. More little spiders. And... This is going to be fun. The Black Widow is one of the hardest enemies in the game. Whoa, is that a Black Widow? All right, come on. Yeah, see how fast she attacks? Yeah. Poison! Um, unfortunately, you have to kind of be at full strength and everything when you go into attack her to begin with. And I was already half dead because of, uh, mm, oversight of mine. And I didn't have any of my combat perks set up. My bad. There we go. Blade Master, Parry Master, Rascal Rogue, Shocking Dismissal. This will be... Much nicer. So. Alright, much better. Yeah. I'll take it. tougher than I they made uh, black widows easier okay dead black widow and I'm envenomated and let's get this milk molar before I go too much further. And, you know, die. Now these should have baby black widows in them. They give five web fiber per, which makes them extremely valuable to get your hands on. Uh, now these uh, Black Widow things, they will give you, um, give me that and that, thank you. They will give you tier three bug parts. So there's the Widow Fang and the Super Spider Venom. Let's go research those really quick. The Makawaddle saved us on that uh, encounter. As you can see, the Black Widows attack stupid fast. And uh, there's only a couple of them in the yard, and I'm pretty sure they don't respawn. But I could be wrong. Maybe they do. We'll find out. Widow Hood, Widow Leggings... I want the Widow Dagger. There it is. What does the Widow Dagger take to craft? The Widow Dagger, Widow Fang, Lint Rope, and Super Spider Venom. So I need um, a couple more Black Widows. Uh, that one will probably respawn, and if it does, I'll just fight it on my own, I guess. Because, um, you know, it does hand me my ass every once in a while, and as you can see, that took two attempts. Now, let's go up and uh, take a look at our base thus far. So we got to go this way, then this way, then up my super giddy stairs. Um, I don't exactly know what that means in English. Giddy giddy. Iffy, maybe. Anyway. 
So up these stairs, and here is our um, platform. I've got as many spinning wheels as I could get materials for, and I want to put, mm, let's see, if I go to this, we go to burr floor, we're going to do that. And let's see, I want to come on, there we go. No, yes, no, like that. Anyway, so we need spiky burrs and lint rope, but in order to get more spiky burrs, we're gonna have to do something. Stupid. Gonna have a look around. See that gas can? We're gonna have to turn it off and let the cordyceps fungus go throughout the yard. Or we're just gonna take a really long time letting these spiky burrs uh, build up because we can get them in the flower pot right there. And that's about it until you turn off this weed killer and then you'll get the spiky burrs all around the tree and stuff. Um, let's see, what do I need to do next? Uh, I think. Super Venom Arrow. And the Widow stuff is light armor. Um, if you can use the Widow stuff with uh, the dagger and do an assassin build, man, you do some serious damage. Um, however, we need uh, more super spider venom. I think I actually have enough raw science that I could um, get that at the uh, fabricator. And then we need to go to the, where is it? We need to go to the undershed. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm not too worried about doing more um, building right now, though maybe I will move all of my materials uh, up here at least and get uh, away from the lower yard. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to move all the materials and then see if I can craft the Widow Dagger and then we'll go to the, um, the Undershed and yeah so i will see you in a minute all right today is the day now comes the time however you want let's to see what's it. around here we need to get uh we need to get to the good stuff i have in my inventory a bunch of broodmother blts and uh, we are ready to go take her on, I think. We've got all of our materials. We've got the Black Ox Crossbow, the Tikamakawattle, the Spicy Coltana, the Toenail Scimitar, the Tiger Mosquito Rapier. Um, we've got the Termite Axe, the Black Ox Hammer, the Black Ant Shovel, and the Widow Dagger. And let's see. Yeah, it's time to get our final armor piece. So I'm going to get back up to the Flingman disc where we can put hopefully a spawn point and we're going to grind out the Broodmother for all of that. See you in a moment. All right one flingman disc later we've got the lean two set up and we've got our coltana which i'm pretty sure is the best weapon to fight bird mother with but i can't remember or rather spicy weapons i i don't really remember so uh yeah i think that's an orb weaver okay well let's get on over here Put one of those in there, and 
You slashing and spicy. Okay. Your hamburger brood, Mom. <laughs> yeah, she's a piece of cake. We're supposed to fight her much sooner than we ended up doing. And you can scream all you want. But, ooh. Okay. I was fatally contaminated. All right, so we got to be a little smarter about this going in. Um, I got a little cocky because, well, it's been a minute, but um, the Broodmother is not hard, but she summons so many minions so quickly that you got to uh, get creative. What's really nice about it, though, is if you fail, you get back the Broodmother BLT. So you can try again. So the best way to do this is to start the fight this way. Now she screams, so we grab this, put one toxic um, Oh, that's right. I need to wear the gas mask when I use the super arrows. I'm an idiot. <laughs> All right. Uh, got her, I guess. Oh, I forgot to pick up the mother BLT from last time. Um, okay, what do we got? Broodmother Fang. And mother chunk all right um ooh, and venom um i have one two three four five i have 14 more of these i'm gonna grind this out and i will be right back with you all right so this is our haul from the uh nice and safe <laughs> Wonderful Broodmother. We've got 15 Broodmother Venom, 30 Broodmother Fangs, and 69. Nice. Uh, Broodmother Chunks. 59. 59, because I suck at math. We also got the Broodmother Trinket, uh, which allows us to do Summon Poison Summon Damage. Uh, we don't currently have a Summon build, but we might be able to do something with that. Now, um, because I have the special torch and whatnot we can actually go and get another mutation on our way back to um, a field station so let's do that let's unset our spawn point here here it is uh right here in the pond by the way We just have to swim down this direction. Keep an eye out for anything else valuable. There's a scabby. Uh, grab that. Chubbs series. Perfect. And then up here. There it is. Four leaf clover. That was upgrade materials too. There we go. The four leaf clover should give us access to the coup de grass. And yeah, I realize it's not supposed to be pronounced like that, but it's still funny as hell. So we can up the coup de grass and then. Uh, I honestly don't need a lot of the materials, but uh, I'll grab them anyway. All right, let's see if I can get up where I need to. At least I think this is the way. Yep, this is the way. All right, perfect. 
we're about to do one of the world changing events um which will like i said it'll unleash the spores on the yard so we won't have to wear the gas mask anymore but uh things aren't necessarily going to be better for us so let's put up the burgle flag first And now... Bum, bum, bum. So it's much easier to navigate all of this now. Um, that'll give us access to... Spiky burrs all along the tree. And. Oh, what else do I have? Yeah, I got to get back to the base. I got to deposit all this stuff. I got to get the broodmother chunks um, researched. So I'm going to do that. I'll be I'll get back to the base and we'll craft up the last set of heavy armor that we're ever going to need and go from there. See you in a minute. All right, I said I was going to wait until we were able to get this right, but here is uh, some of the, uh, what do you call them? Scarabs. I gathered these up while I was up in the upper yard and I was like, you know what? I'll just research them. I'll run back home and we can start some of the mighty globs. Um, I think the Mighty Globs need the... They need everything? Yeah, so the Mighty Globs need the Supreme Whetstone and Twinkling Shell. The Sour Jewels need Sour Lumps, Twinkling Shell, Supreme Whetstone. So we're actually going to craft up the, uh, or the Mighty Ones, and hopefully we'll be able to upgrade something. Oh, yay. Um... Black ox burger, don't mind if I do. Damn, we'll consume one of those. Of and, um, yeah, so I'm going to run back and forth to the upper yard for a little bit and see if I can't get, um, everything upgraded. Now, these twinkly bastards, they're kind of a bitch to catch. Uh, with the black ox crossbow, they're actually pretty easy to pin down. But I will show you a surefire way to get your hands on some of them every day uh, in just a minute. So I will be back with you in just a little bit. Got to wait for this to be done. All right. Too many hours and whatever later. Took so long. Um, I have... Level 9 Toenail Scimitar, level 9 Widow Dagger, level 9 Spicy Coltana, level 9 Termite Axe, level 9 Black Ox Hammer, level 9 Black Ant Shovel. I don't think there's a tier 3 shovel. God, I hope there's not a tier 3 shovel. Level 9 Black Ox Crossbow, which we will get the Wasp Bow. Uh, when we get a chance, that's a an, also a tier three weapon. I think it might actually be a tier four, like the only tier four in the game. Anyway, uh, we also have the Tick Makwaddle. And I got everything else up to level nine. I got our demon mother thingy to level nine. We've got Thor's Pendant, Ladybird Shield, and currently I have the Tiger uh, Rapier equipped. And uh, everything should be going good. So I will meet you over at the entrance to the Undershed. All right. So I think if we get on top of the lawnmower, we can actually get to something pretty cool. But I honestly don't recall um, how to get up top. So hold please while I figure it out. Well, it's probably about time that we... Yeah. 
and died of poison. There we go. Uh, it's probably about time that we get on the wasps. We're going to need to get on them in a moment anyway. So might as well make it now. And then we need to figure out how to get up on top of that thing over there. They definitely changed things up. There's some candy in here. And I believe this is a tier three. Yeah, tier three chewed gum. Uh, let me out, please. Okay. Life me, I cannot remember what their weakness is. Uh, weakness is salty. Okay. Drone, come on. You are a different creature entirely. Oh, no. oh, okay. So the wasp drone also weak to um salty. Where the fuck are you? You're ridiculously loud. And now you're poisoned. I don't feel so good. Let's drink some human food. I've been poisoned. Kill it. Now you. Okay. We killed the wasp. Very much in a bad way right now. We've got wasp shell and legs, so we probably need those. Oh yeah, this is how you can get rust. You, uh, the toolbox is full of it, but you can get it all over the yard. Now can this, this is the wasp hive so yes the wasps should be aware of my presence we got the wasp paper taken care of and come on You're getting poisoned in three different ways, lady. There we go. Now, how the hell do I get up on top of the lawnmower? Is it really as simple as what the hell? Does this leaf not exist? Okay. So we're up on the lawn mower, I guess. Seriously, what's the best way to get there? Uh, let's try that one more time. <laughs> Damn it. Mm 
Let me figure this out. All right, I think this counts as being up on the, uh, the lawnmower, but we'll see in a second. Yes, we're up on the lawnmower. So we should be able to make it pretty damn far. Uh, we might even be able to make it all the way to, well, up on the wall. That's our goal anyway. And dead mosquito. The only good bug is a dead bug. All right, you see this branch that goes up there? We are trying to get up to that ledge right there. And the best way to do that is uh, to build up to it. But barring that, we have the very, very stupid option of some parkour. So we're going to do that. All right, whew. I absolutely hate that section. Um, and for the record, I fell like nine times. So I'm growing tired of this game. Only because, you know, it's kicking my ass left and right. Come on. There we go. Sticky key. And do I need anything else? No, probably not. Let's grab these. Wow, that was a lot of shards. Oh, that was two of them. Never mind. I was like, that is a lot of shards. No, it's really not. All right. Uh, onward and upward, I guess. I'll meet you over by the um, shed unless something super interesting happens. Oh, wait a second. Let's see what's around here. There's a moth. Yeah, the moth. I get the feeling that the moth was kind of an afterthought in the game because it, this is its animation. Tony Kaku. Let's get going. Don't die. Okay. Alrighty. So. The under shed is exactly what it sounds like. It's under the shed. Can't remember if there's anything in here. Hold up. Doesn't appear to be. Okay. And this is a spooky place. Super spooky. We're going to carry the torch in this one because I want to be completely armored. All right, here we go. Um, what's that? Berry leather, salt arrows, salt shards, heal basso. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's a splatter. Sweet. Did I not bring any of those? No, I brought all of them. We good. Oh, analyzer. Yay. Okay, so wasp dote, wasp paper lamp, and wasp paper partition. And stuffed wasp and wasp mount from the leg. And this one will be the one that doesn't give us armor. Never mind. Frostbitten recipe. A note detailing how to harness the natural refrigeration powers of ice cap mints to preserve food. Uh, yeah, so that gives us... Um, that gives us... What do you call it? Uh, the freezer. Craft this, no this. Where is it? There it is. Fresh storage. So this is the biggest storage in the game. Uh, it's also the most expensive storage in the game. But if you can build it, it's very beneficial. All right, let's listen to this. Working in the dark is playing tricks on my mind. I fear every shadow. Hear whispers in the silence. 
But most of all, I miss my family. Ah, oh, Trudy and her crooked grin. The way she rolled her eyes at my dumb jokes. <laughs> Sarah, my little angel. How she would jump into oh. my arms every time I yeah, walked through the door up, after work. Just a cold, musty wasteland of terror and death. A really tiny one. Not that that helps me now. Well, oh, that doesn't help. All right, there's termites and roly polies and lots of black ox beetles. Let's go this way. I think the roly polies are docile until we give them a reason to not be, which is kind of nice. Got that guy. And got you. What's this? Raw science storage of this is tricky. It's imperative to keep it cool and out of the sun. Luckily, this crawl space is the perfect environment for both. Once the lab is complete, I can begin my trials of direct raw science infusion. I must know whether this byproduct particle originates from the subject or the process, as I originally assumed. The only way to know for sure is to infuse myself with um, variable doses. Dangerous? Quite. But it must be done, or I am doomed. If I can replenish these rogue particles in my body, perhaps I can finally reverse this raisinification. All right, cool. Raw science. So... I really wish we could light up this area just for the sake of being able to see what it really looks like. But, um, I don't think there's even like console commands for this game. So, oh, fuck. That's where I wanted to be. And back we go. There we go. Much better. Okay. I jump down onto the corpse. Perfect. Now you'll notice there's a glint. Having a little peek. A glimmer. You fucking cow. There's a glint of color up here. This is the easiest place to get your hands on the scarabs. Bad little bugger here. And there should always be three of them here. So if you look, it says they're weak to everything, uh, which is beneficial because they're a bitch to kill. Oh, there's four of them. There's not usually four of them, but uh, uh, yeah, cool. All right. And There we go. Dead mosquitoes. Okay, so we have to make it. Uh, ooh, pupa. We don't need any more pupa right now. Um, if we can make it across this over here, 
And then across Yeah. Oh, you talk. Come on. Frick knows bastards. Little spiders give me the creeps. Little spy. Oh. Shit. Uh. Widowlings. Well, we know what that means. We need our wonderfulness. Fuck off. Let's go to our mutations. We'll swap out. Shocking dismissal. No, actually, Mithridandatism doesn't do anything. So. Okay, I just killed your babies. How do you feel about it, Black Widow? You are weak to salty. And you... Yeah, come at me. I can take out the widowlings first. Mama's easy. The widowlings are the ones that'll tack on the venom damage. Ooh. Alrighty then. Your venom isn't as strong as I remember. And with you tacking on venom damage, uh, I guess we're fine. That's odd. I seem to remember them hitting harder. But maybe I'm wrong? Ooh, milk molar. Yes, please. 